What's good? What's good? What's good? What's going on, family? How you doing? I got a meeting in a minute, but I wanted to come in and give you a quick little message. Um, I just want to once again, as I always start, I just appreciate everyone who is, is sharing these messages and who's just taking them in, just taking them in. I just want to continue to grow and I want to continue to read and continue to stretch in order to help everyone who watches these videos, just help them understand that if I can do it, you know, the kid that got kicked out of two different high schools, graduated from an alternative school, there's nothing that you can't do. So um, I just want to encourage you today. I just want to encourage you to understand that Yesterday doesn't care about tomorrow and tomorrow is not concerned about yesterday, you know, so we have to continue to be concerned about what our future is going to be like and our future is going to be whatever we make it. But it's going to be a choice that we're going to have to make in order to to want to have that future that we truly deserve. See, it's all up to us. It's all up to us. It's never been about somebody else. It's always been about us. The moment we understand this, I got this new thing that I talk about, about breaking through the Matrix. Many of you know The Matrix is my favorite movie. I feel like with The Matrix, we just go to work. We go home. We take care of our kids. We go to sleep. And we wake up and do it again. I believe that we can live an extraordinary life, but we got to break through the matrix. We got to break through that thing that's trying to hold us back. See, that's what life wants to do. Life wants to just have a whole bunch of average, ordinary people. And you know that's not you. You're truly extraordinary. You've always been extraordinary, but you got to put the work in. You got to put the work in. You got to put the work in when somebody else is saying, man, I'm tired. And then you agree with them because your body going to be tired too. But your mind can't get tired. Your mind has to continue to create the future that you deserve. You got to be about that life. You got to be about that life. You got to be about the life that you deserve. I always say that because there is there's a level of living that we're supposed to be living at. There is. There is. But a lot of times we settle. We settle in relationships. We settle in our careers. We settle for so many things that are so beneath us. And then we look back and we say, gosh, what if I would have? We don't have to look back. We can start today. Today, we can start to do the things that we need to do, but it's not going to be easy. It's going to be hard. It's going to be hard because life is trying to see if you truly, truly want it. And it's supposed to be hard because it's trying to separate the people who really want it from the people who kind of want it. The people who want out of this matrix, this doing things again and again and again the way that other people do it or to do something different. See, my thing now that I'm trying to do is I'm trying to constantly hang around people who are successful, people who are smarter than me. Because what that's going to do is it's going to force me to get in what our, where I fit in. You know, it's just like if we were walking. If me and you were walking around a track, I'm either going to keep up with your pace or you're going to keep up with my pace. And I tell you what, my walk now is just brisk. I'm trying to get there. I'm trying to get there because I don't know how much time I got on this planet. So I want to make sure I'm getting there. So that's what we do. If we hang around people who stretch us to grow, we're going to go to the level and have the opportunities that they have. Remember, success leaves clues. The clues are left all around us. But we got to be careful to pick up the clues, careful to acknowledge the clues, and more than anything, careful to know that we deserve it. You deserve it. All right. Quick little message. I will holler at you. I hope you have a phenomenal day. Peace.